Hello everyone and welcome to another game of Civ 6 where we are playing the BBG mod that stands for Better Balanced Game. Let's see if that is actually the case. There is seven players in this game today, me being one of them, and the other six are as follows. Introduce yourself and the Civ you're playing as you do so. My name's Daltos, I'm playing Canada. Hi, Daltos. Can you guys? Oh, <laughs> I'm the <laughs> I'm playing. We're, sti we're sticking with this intro because we've tried like multiple intros before. <laughs> this is the just, one that's going out on YouTube. Just so we're just gonna roll with it. Just this load in the now. other intro. Hi, okay. I'm Potato McWhiskey, and I'm playing Gandhi. Excellent. That's India or something. Thank Hello. You. Hello. Yeah, yes. Hello, I'm Alex the Rambler, and I'm playing Korea. Hello, I'm Dr. Simon Clark, and I'm playing America. <laughs> Hey, I'm the Spiffing Brit and I'm playing Mansa Musa. Yo, in the edits, can you just have like gold flying across the screen? Come on. <laughs> yeah. You can do it. I believe in you, Chris. I love gold. It's like a, bo <laughs> like a Bobby B meme. It's like every yeah. single Mansa Musa. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, bonjour. Wee oui, wee. Oui, I am Gay Paddy. I'm also Duncan. <laughs> <laughs> By the way. That's the secondary thing. Oh, I think that's hello. everyone, right? Well, hello. excellent. How are, how are your starts, gentlemen? Have, has it gone horrible? My chat has informed me that this is a good start. I am not. I am uh, in the desert, which I was me not too. expecting as Maya. I'm I've gonna got, say. I've got a river going around my whole city. You've got some mountains, some cotton. Uh, I think it's all right. Cool. I, uh, I've got the Eye of the Sahara. Ooh. In the thrill of the fight. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. oh, I've got the Nak Dong River. <laughs> Dong. <laughs> I get it. Because that's a, that's the like earliest penis. honk. Yeah. Can I just say? <laughs> yeah. Very nice. Um. So capitals need mm. names. Uh. We have a couple of people who donated. So might as yeah. Well let's do those donations these now. Names. Um. Uh. Colbrander is happy to see Simon back and is asking for a city named Colbrander. K O L B R A N D R. Should be a Simon C, surely. So, exactly. Uh, can, you, can you spell that again, please? Cal I Brander. will type it in the chat. Uh, he asks, Has Biff ever been on a Segway? I imagine he would be great, as he's perfectly balanced. Oh, if there's I, a I, I submit my name for consideration. A lot of line I, I used to um, drive space. Segways for a job. Oh, really? What yeah, job? I, um, <laughs> kind of I, segway driver. I, gave, I gave tours <laughs> of. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> At, at Leeds As Castle, they, they have Segway tours. And I, I used remember to be you told me about tour this. guide. Yeah. Yeah, so I used to drive people around on Segways. Smoothly going from topic to topic. Um, I once <laughs> witnessed someone, well, it was we, I was driving a group of like six or eight people up to the viewpoint, and um, there, were, there was a, a lady and a gentleman <laughs> uh, going at it right at the height of the viewpoint where we were driving up to. So that you was a bit awkward. Fighting or having Wait, you were wrestling? You were a tour guide. Yeah. Doesn't that require, like, you that know, not being like socially an awkward? insanely awkward <laughs> tour. <laughs> <laughs> I, I haven't. What? No, look. This is my. Mm, You're proving our I, point, Alex. <laughs> I am. I'm perfectly capable of of speaking coherently to people when I choose to. So you, you just don't like choose us. Choose not to. For yeah. us. <laughs> <laughs> what did we do to you? <laughs> I mean, it, it's hard. There's like, there's one person watching the stream. He's like talking it's, to like seven people. It's like, it's yeah. tough. It's basically just learning a script. So I just regurgitated the same words again and again. So it's it's pretty pretty easy to do. Yeah. Oh, my river flooded already, and I have extra yield. Oh, Damn boy. you! Are you I sure you're not the, playing? Uh, would I lie intensity. to you, Alex? It sounds like a "Would I lie to you" like prompt. Yeah. I can drive around a Segway for I a living. Can, <laughs> Wait, I can what? spare. <laughs> I can say I, I, have my <laughs> I have David photographic Mitchell evidence. <laughs> uh, there, there is photographic evidence, and it's also on my CV, so I can't be lying. Fair enough. Wow. When was the last time no, anyone no one lies on their CV? That's true. It, Why would I lie about last... that? That's not something you want to lie yeah. about, really. <laughs> I mean, when was the last time anyone here updated their CV? I haven't had to update mine for quite a while. I don't have I have... Yeah, I've got um, a real job. Mine <laughs> was like. Like probably like nine or ten years ago, I wrote mine probably. So it has not been updated since. I had to do it for my immigration stuff recently. Ah, uh, fair enough. 
I've got a really weird start. I've been given two builders from Goody Huts. So what? really, you you found a Goody Hut? Yeah, I haven't found. I don't a goody have hut. a Goody Hut yet. I found barbs. Me too. They're like a Goody Same. Hut, only they oh, bite buddy. you. They're like pointy Goody Huts. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right. I found a Goody Hut. Oh, I can choose my pamphlet. Yes. You. Pantheon oh, already? already? I'm, oh, he's I'm Marley. Marley. I'm Marley. He's Marley. Really Marley and Marley, our hearts were painted black. I'm not going I, for a religion this uh, game, I've decided. I, I have a feeling Spiff is going oh, for the desert adjacency work ethic thing. You need more oh, of my dear. hair. I mean, I'm considering it. Do you guys want to see what it? I did to my Potato. hair? Potato, whereabouts is it in that lovely sure. list? Yeah, Only so to get plus one faith adjacency from desert tiles. Oh yes, of course, I should be going for that one, shouldn't I? And yes. then I can go for the thing which gives me production from my holy sites. Oh yes, it all makes sense now. However, oh. I will give you a warning. If if your holy sites get pillaged, that production goes away forever because it's bugged. So Classic Civ 6, classic. <laughs> <laughs> well, that just ruins Biff's entire game plan, honestly. No, I'll just have to put it in a garbage wasteland where you'd never want to go for it. <laughs> I was thinking more Habubi dust storms. I oh, thought they'd be. Oh, aren't they right? Are the they called storms. Haboobs? Not Haboobies. No, they're no, Haboobies. Haboobies. <laughs> Stop yeah. talking about her boobs. <laughs> <laughs> they're serious shit, guys. <laughs> they're, they're potentially devastating sandstorms. <laughs> <laughs> but they have oh, a silly no. name. Oh, <laughs> oh, ding dong. That's that's Spiff's exploits being delivered. <laughs> oh, ooh, I found Zanzibar. Now I'm making an extra four gold per turn. Ooh, I found a Zanzibar barbarian. Zanzibar. Zanzibar barbarian. <laughs> There's a lot of desert where I am. It, it, yeah. It's the Namib Desert. You spawn next to me then, because I'm just surrounded by desert. I guess, maybe. I'm Have also near a giant yet? desert. Maybe this is just a desert map. Uh, right, what am I doing? Uh, Great. Right, yeah. My one Good goodie map. hut boosted a, a, a research oh. that was a turn away from researching anyways. Oh. Yeah, my tribal village gave me one era score. I don't know if that's... I haven't found one. I'll never so understand just... era scores. Mm. I understand loyalty more now. Yeah? You sound like a mob boss when you say that. Did you, um... <laughs> I have uh, now. understand I what it means to be loyal. <laughs> <laughs> I value loyalty. <laughs> I'm building my holy site, and it's going to give me plus uh, six, uh, six faith adjacency. Oh, yeah. Which would be nice and tasty. That is pretty tasty. Is that because of the Pantheon? Yeah, and also Marley being Marley. I'm getting plus five on the Valtmat Pantheon. I'm getting plus one in hashtag free self. Because I have a natural wonder and it's next to that and a mountain. Oh, very nice. Ooh, nice. Ooh, nice. 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 All right, I'm Maya, which means I have to do the whole place pins to figure out where to place things uh, if i can remember how everything works which i can oh we must have the efficiently five compacted cities yeah yeah <laughs> if not then then why am i even playing let's be honest oh it's my turn okay <clears throat> is anyone else unable to hear voice what does that mean it means he hasn't got his volume turned up it means is anyone else unable to hear voice Oh my god. I can ah, definitely hear her. Yeah, I could hear I could hear that. I want. Ooh, I like it that they gave settlers extra movement as well. You can kinda of get around a bit quicker. Yeah, it's a bit of skirting to be done. Get around. I get around. Round round. I get around. <laughs> Welcome to the Beach Boys cast, everyone. Uh... <laughs> uh... Oh, mm. I've encountered Rivian, apparently. Yes, we ran what? into each other. Oh, well, that's right. Oh, right. Game oh, audio right. on for everybody. I play without noise or without audio. 
Yeah, I do the same. It just, God, I know, just it helps me focus. Gotta listen to the music and the sound effects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, ba, hoo. Is that too loud, chat? I don't know anymore. That could be a city. Let's get a scout, shall we? Can I buy a scout yet? Oh, I can buy a. I can buy a scout actually. My big problem is I had a I had a shit ton of ear infections as a kid, so I'm practically deaf. So I don't listen to anyone when they talk and stuff like that. Like I can't oh, hear it clearly. Oh, yeah. Shit, there's a burning rainforest here. I have a similar thing, but it's just that I don't care what people say, so I don't yeah. listen to them. There's mm -hmm. a burning rainforest. That's that's new. Oh, wait, are we playing an apocalypse right actually? No. no. I just got ten horses from a goodie hut. What kind of garbage <laughs> goodie hut? How are you is that? finding all these goodie hut? That's what I want to know. I picked four ten goodie huts. strong right? horses. But like, <laughs> like two of them were have a free builder. Another one was have twenty gold, and then ten horses. What can I do with that? I haven't even put. I haven't put people on horses yet. <laughs> this is worthless. <laughs> I, I love the image of you turning up to like this little that. tribal hut and they're like, this is all we have to offer you, but it's, it's, it's the horses. finest we have. Like, it's like, it's just shit. useless. <laughs> <laughs> Who packed 10 horses in the one tiny hut? Oh my god, Twitch is so broken. It's saying, yeah, it's just saying you have one, one viewer. viewer. It's just going up <laughs> and down. I don't know why. <laughs> Duncan, you're outnumbering the mainstream by 100 to 1. <laughs> oh my god. Outnumbered, out man. Yeah, I, wa I watched it the other day as well. So good, <laughs> sort of. It is. It, it, I don't. I don't think there's any sort of about it. I think it's really good. I think they lip synced. I'm sorry. I don't care what anyone you says. You are just wrong. I don't care yep. what anyone says. I was watching. Incorrect. <laughs> I was watching them trying to. The there, there seemed some parts where there wasn't lip syncing, but some of them. I mean, come on. No, I think you're just wrong, mate. There's I, no way. <laughs> It's like what watching Britney about? Spears dance around and sing at the top of her lungs. She's not doing In that. In this house, we respect Lin Manuel Miranda, Daltos. <laughs> I refuse. What? He went and played this? for Trump. I don't Hamilton. respect that. No, no, no. Oh. He played for Pence, and then the the cast were like, "Oh, excuse me, we'd like to very respectfully, you know, make a statement here." And Pence was like, "Well, this is fucking bullshit." And Again, like, he just no, left. He just left. <laughs> it's like, what the hell, man? Also, the story uh, is incredibly wrong. Yeah, it is historically quite inaccurate. I haven't like completely like inaccurate. A historical like, music inaccurate? No. No. <laughs> Hamilton much... was the douche in that scenario. Aaron Burr was the good guy. Also, like when they make they make the big deal about Philip dying, like he literally had another son afterwards and called him Philip. Like yeah. he made a replacement. Yeah. For that. <laughs> Get over it. You know? um, how much do you learn about Hamilton in school, actually? Not a lot. Usually, uh, we, we go over his ge like general things. I had to teach American history over and over again because people—that's that, just oh, what we learn. Yeah. Um, like you'll learn about like the Articles of Confederation. You learn about the main founding fathers, and it's usually like Thomas Jefferson, mm -hmm. James Madison, uh, and uh, George Washington. John Adams gets forgotten, even though he's a great person, and he raised a great son, who's probably one of our best presidents of all time. Is that John Quincy Adams? Yeah. John Quincy Adams was the guy who kept uh, slavery uh, in in the public mind, and was like, hey, this is bad. Can we keep voting oh, on I this? I thought you were like, he was a great president. He kept, he kept slavery. slavery. No, it's, <laughs> like, yeah. it's like, guys, we got all these slaves. Can we vote to free them? And everyone was like, shut the fuck up. And he was like, no, but serious. We got all these slaves. Like, Seriously, though. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, Mike... <laughs> She's gonna kill me for saying this, but my my partner, my my fiance now actually, and I um, I would watched kill Hamilton. You for saying that too. We watched Hamilton the other night, and then the following day, she said, "So, who who were America fighting in the Revolutionary War?" Ah, 
Like who? Who were Who was their independence from? And I was like, who did you think that they were fighting what? the good guys? Okay, the good guys. <laughs> I was like, we would just watch out. Who did you think that king was? And he was. She was like, oh, I thought it was like the king of France or something. Oh <laughs> yes, well yes, known. He king was. Of France. <laughs> Well, you know, it's it, it, she took she enjoyed the music. That's the important That's thing. Good, yeah, I mean, <laughs> sounds like she's I, learned I something will, as well. I will admit, <laughs> I did not know who Alexander Hamilton was before. Ah, he's a minor game. guy. Oh. He was yeah. so the the real story about Hamilton was he was a political savant. He made a whole bunch of people like him at the right time, and he got into a bunch of good positions, specifically the Treasury of the United States. He ran that. He also he founded the Coast Guard, right? Yeah, and like. Um, that was the other thing, is they didn't even want a national bank. Washington put that in, and they're like, what the fuck? And then your girlfriend's also kind of right in that, like, they weren't American. They considered themselves British. It yeah. was a British on British fight. And if you did consider yourself American, you more considered yourself, like, by your state more than anything. Than yeah, or you're giant. like your town or municipality yeah. or whatever. It's wow. just not something our like our history in the UK, like as it's taught in schools, is so myopic. It's like you're going to learn a fuckload about the Tudors and mm -hmm. the Roman Empire, Same. and that's kind of it. Like you, you never cover stuff like I mean, we covered when I did GCSE history and we did the Weimar Republic and we did the Northern Ireland Troubles. That was kind of the only really international stuff that we did. The GCSE stuff I did was mainly the Wild West. Uh, and Jack the Ripper. Oh, it's like fun. a different. It's a different curriculum. Well, at least like yeah, I could. Where, where I had did you learn there was Jack the them. West, Jack the Ripper, and Wild West? I don't know. It's, it's really, it's really dumb. Uh, I would have preferred the. There were two different history um, types you could go for. I had to go for that particular one because I wanted to do drama. So it, right. would, it conflicted with the. Yeah. Uh. yeah. Yeah, I see what you're that's, saying. That's literally schools in a nutshell. I had to go for this option because it conflicted with uh, my timetable. Well, you know yeah. why you did it? It's because if you ever try to, and this is the big thing holding back whenever people are like, why don't they teach life skills in school? It's because you only have eight hours in a day. And if you drop yeah. anything else, you're going to get parents coming in. And also, I, I hate to tell people, but taxes are really fucking boring. Like, it's horrible. You don't want to learn taxes. <laughs> uh, I do think it's it would be responsible for people to at least learn about personal finances and debt because it's the way oh, the civilization the way, managers, the way yeah. civilizations are nowadays is just like it's a debt culture right especially america well what we need to do as like uh an american education system is reevaluate the core classes we teach english uh history science and math and the, not every kid needs to learn history english science and math and that's only four hours a day. Then we have like gym that takes up an hour, another hour goes to, to lunch, and then another hour to study hall, and then you have one hour left, and that's usually an elective, you know? So it's like, it, it's really hard to fit in something new in a school. I, like, it's only when you are a teacher, or in my case, I like, I live with one, um, like, you only then realize how fucking hard education is. Like, I think as a kid, you're like, oh, this is, this is bullshit. This is, this just sucks. And it's like, you never think of it from the other perspective. Oh, yeah. Like, it's a tough job. That's why I say thank your principal, because the principal has to deal with the most bullshit out You get long holidays, though. Do you guys have an hour of gin every day in school? Yeah, and it's pathetic, because you go in... You change for 15 minutes because kids drag their ass on purpose. I fucking hate it. And then you have to walk them all the way out to the fucking track, which is another 15 minutes. And then you have like 30 minutes left to run around. It's like, it's so bad. I hate, I used to sub gym and I used to hate subbing that class because it's just like, ugh. Mm. Sounds like a nightmare. Because I remember having, I think, gym once a week, and it was like a multi-hour class. Yeah, well. that's how it should be. Gym should be stuff to do. Gym should be spaced out every two days. So it should be Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, that way it actually lines up with, like, having muscles rest and, and recuperate. Yeah, that's that seems like a good idea. And you could do more. Our Plus, gym was, like, once a week, and we just played football on the concrete. Yeah. That's the other thing is gym is highly regulated by insurance, so you can't do shit anymore in gym classes. It's so boring. Can't play dodgeball. Can't even play basketball in some schools because you get a head injury. Uh, soccer's banned from some can't schools. Can't play basketball. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not even joking. Wow. Who took the uh, Panthenon for well, the we free settler? rugby at school. Right? That would probably be Potato because he mentioned having a settler up nice and early. Uh, I was thinking about taking it, but I actually took River Goddess because I'm going to build a oh. giant civilization. Oh. Oh, yeah, I suppose you're a little... I got it. Oh, oh you did. Goddess. 
who took this thing that I took? Well, I, 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 I was looking through all of the things that I could get. And then... Hey, everybody, I'm the river goddess. Where is, uh... Yeah, there it is. Okay. I see. Hmm. Here it is. <laughs> is anyone else building the Great Bath? No. 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 I, I don't even... I haven't seen a river yet. Oh, wait, no, there's I was one. considering it, but... Eh. Brilliant. It's going to take too long. Uh, ten turns isn't that bad. It is when people are running out their turns every turn. <laughs> Alex! I, I was picking my pants on. <laughs> you were doing it too, Dunk. It takes a while. It takes Dunk, a while. you literally opened up a fucking package instead of... I was doing a live unboxing. <laughs> I thought we could open it. What people wanted to see. I was just curious what it was, because they had the address wrong. Ah, yeah. Ah. <laughs> it was everything that was correct, except it was in Bath. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Everything was fine, apart from it was the wrong city. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Luckily, That's a pretty fucking big thing. problem. Apparently you don't need it. <laughs> you can say it right any city you want, as long as the postcode is correct. Wait, so Ooh. I had a Bristol postcode, but like a bar. Three, one, two, three. Right, the bath instead of Bristol, yeah. We'll click over the five. Let's get a trade, so maybe. I, I almost declared war on a city-state by accident. That would have been a big oof. I want to make a big zoo. I mean, a big zoo. <laughs> not, like, not like Civ 5 where you can run in there and just nab all of their workers and mm -hmm. then they're yeah. out. I'm also having a problem with barbarians. Uh, so the way to fight barbarians is to kill them before they see your city and their scout activates. And yeah. Too late! Yeah. If, 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 they, yeah. if the scout gets back, then suddenly they, they start like printing barbarians yeah. out. Yeah. That happened to me. Barbarian printer go burr. Well, I it takes my uh, slinger firepower. You really know you're having a, ba a bad game when you get the uh, the boost for actually killing a unit with a slinger. That's yeah. Really yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I might be getting there, actually. I'm, doing, I'm getting there. I fucked up. I shouldn't have... Uh, You'll be fine. Well, I shouldn't have let these, these barbs get back to their camp. I ran my scout away to go look for goody huts instead. And my warriors could pull you out of position. Hey Duncan, how's uh, the package doing? Oh, sorry, I was just appointing a governor. Oh, a governor. <laughs> oh. Can, I, can I just say that's a sentence I wasn't expecting to hear? So, how's the package doing? How's, how's the package Hanging doing? Low. Uh, pretty, pretty sweet. Uh, it's it's always a sweet package with you. Do your balls hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Oh, shh. How can you build on maze? Bombs. Do I not? Alright, oh, yeah. Confusion. Something amazing. <laughs> that makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> the button wasn't there, so I saw it, but then it was. <laughs> I'm feeling very isolated. I'm like, I haven't seen anyone. I've met like two city states. Yeah, I'm pre I've, I've, I'm near Granada and Cahokia. Granada? And that's like, yeah. <laughs> Granada. 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 <laughs> Your St. Louis isn't too far from my capital. Like, probably like 10, 10, 10 20 tiles. Oh, okay, so you're well, the other side well, of this. 13. The other Volcano, side of the yeah. Delaware River? Oh, no. Yes, I am. Right. Right. Should we make that the logical border? Yep, that works for me. Cool. And then Gr Granada and Cahokia, that's like another border. I think I managed yeah. to find every single uh, barb. I found every barb. I just found a barbarian horse. Now I'm scared. Dune. Chad, I know he does. I know I don't benefit from snow tiles. I'm looking at uh, these resources around instead. Juicy resources. Who's this? Yeah. No, no, how did I not take that? Oh. Clark. Hello. We meet on the field of battle. Oh, uh, uh, what? <laughs> That's news to me. <laughs> Where are you? You're ah, hello. Your builders make like a grunting noise when they build something. I, I'm glad I never played with audio on. Was it Ooh. was it four where the, the audio was specific to the Civ as well? Really? Like it would be like the English workers would be like, "What do you need?" And, uh, well, yes, that does sound I think familiar. So, yeah, yeah. And then they and were I, like, "Oh, that's a terrible idea. <laughs> Let's never implement that again." <laughs> I think like the German ones would say German stuff to you too, right? Yeah, yeah. Each Civ had its own language. Like the Roman ones were in Latin and that kind of stuff. 
it, it kind of reminds me of Age of Empires when the workers would say like, yeah. like almost, <laughs> like other things, like eat I was like, what language is that? We, we <laughs> Rogan. We time people out Rogan? in chat for a Who long is? message. <laughs> I love this. Why do we do that? Yeah, I don't know. It's just a like, gaffa. Mo Mooba hates long messages, I guess. That's, That's just stupid. <laughs> God damn it. I thought I'd grab a barbarian camp and, I, and then it was left at 1 HP and then next turn my, I died and now it's gonna oh. bring 50,000 barbarians down my city. It's war now with the barbarians. It's war. There's one guy it's running back being like, <laughs> Oh God, they killed the rest yeah. of them. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. faith. Thank Pretty God. Much. Thank you, Goody Hot. The 10 faith. It's not wrong with 10 faith. Eh. I don't want it. We're godless people, can't Canadians. You know? Savages to the north. That's what I call them. Savages. 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 Barely even human. human. 